Welcome to Cynthia Porter's studio. I'm Cindy and this is my exploration into fluid art. Bloom paints that I had mixed up and I was able to save these. Um, I watered them down with the Jaywa, which is you may not know is 30% Josanya gloss or Josanya varnish and 70% water and you can use that to thin out your bloom paints but I'm really not going to use them for a bloom per se because I don't want to spin and I really am not wanting to tilt what I'm wanting to do is I'm wanting to play with this palette knife I've been wanting this shape forever and I finally got it and um, so I'm gonna play with this and what I've added to those colors is I've added a uh, tooth paint um, Amsterdam Prussian Rose to go along with these and then with the pinks I wanted to add this green gold by Goldens that I've mixed with Australian Floetrol and um, I did do a test piece and I really didn't get a lot of cells and stuff from it but that may be because I wasn't blowing it out and all that stuff but I still I love the color combination it, it's, it reminds me of the bedroom I had when I was in sixth grade and that my mother did for me with all these flowers and floral wallpaper and all that. So that's what I'm going to go for. And I'm going to use the house paint. And this is a medallion, Valspar White. And I'm really just going to put this on thin because like I said I am not wanting to have to spin and blow I might blow a little bit with my straw but I'm not wanting to make a mess of it it's been so hot here as I'm sure it has been everywhere kind of makes makes it hard to pull out the paints when it's you know over 80 degrees in the studio and these bloom paints they were about two months old and they were thicker than modeling paste i promise you put my tooth paint the Prussian Rose and I didn't write down my other colors so I'm gonna try to remember it and I'll put them down for you because what I wanted to do in remembrance of my 12 year old self I wanted to make some pretty flowers. I'm thinking this is funk. I may be wrong by TLP. figure it out and I know this one is sequence by TLP so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna shake up this cell activator like Donna tells me to do she's shake the bejesus out of it.
I'm going to put you guys on music now so I can listen to some music because I think I'm wanting to listen to, I can't even say his name right, Pablo Santini. He's a uh, artist out of Scotland and I really love him. <laughs> I wish I could share him with y'all, but I can't. Darn it. <laughs> so I'll see you at the end.
everyone. So now I'm back with my dried results of my tulips. Um, I don't know quite what to call this technique because uh, I just don't know. Anyways, I want to thank everyone for joining us this Friday. And if you're seeing me at a later date, I want to thank you for watching. So after me, I want to send you on to Janet of, what is it? Acrylic Creations by Jay Witty. It's such a tongue twister for me. And after her, you're going to go on to uh, Donna at It's Art by Donna M. And I hope you hit up Nate before you got to me. So until next time, I'm going to wish you guys a bunch of peace, love, light, and lots and lots of laughter. And I hope you're staying cool. And I love y'all. Bye-bye.